Good afternoon. My name's Dan Medlin. I own Meddling Machine Works in Marietta, Ohio. I've been a machinist for basically 25 years. I started out in the Navy and have continued it periodically through my civilian life. Uh, a few years ago, I went back to Ohio University and learned CNC machining, which was new to me. And I acquired a few years later some antique CNC equipment and started learning how to run it. And as time went on, I had started doing jobs for friends, relatives, neighbors. And in a very short period of time, it went viral on me. I went from being just a guy thinking he was going to have a retirement business to now, now I do it 16 hours a day, seven days a week, uh, nonstop. I put up a couple of small videos on YouTube and was overwhelmed with response. And the Raptor makes all the parts for them. It makes thousands of parts for me. We run this thing as much as 16 hours a day or as long as I can run. It makes beautiful parts again and again and again with intolerance, beautiful surface finish and orders were rolling in so fast and the, equ the antique equipment wasn't dependable enough in a matter of just two months I got so far behind on orders it started affecting my business. I realized I had to do something quickly to increase production. I started searching around and Smithy Automate was the only person that I contacted in the United States that had machines on the floor. Everybody else was three to six months out and that wasn't going to help me in my current situation. I found Smithy and Automate uh, actually from an ad that they had in uh, eBay for a piece of equipment that they were selling. We bought uh, the Raptor here and I can't say enough about the machine. I, I, I've, I've ran a lot of equipment, very robust equipment in my day and this machine is absolutely top-notch. I have to talk about the robustness of this machine. When I first got it, I made a slight mistake of the decimal point being in the wrong spot and it rapided at 800 inches a minute into a piece of inch and a half aluminum, 6061. It bent the aluminum and broke a quality made 8 inch cast iron chuck and I was almost in tears because I knew there was no way that I didn't damage this machine that I just bought something and I broke it within a short period of time of having it. I replaced the chuck with another one that I have. I put the dial indicators on it as I did when it was brand new and it was still within two ten thousandths the spindle was still accurate within two ten thousandths and I, I couldn't believe it. It was amazing. I, I was afraid I had ruined a brand new machine. With uh, the success that I've had with the machine here and with my business, uh, micro manufacturing is coming back. Industry's coming back to the states and machines such as this are helping startup guys like myself get in to do things that an individual never thought they could do. The Smithy Automate tools and equipment, uh, the sky's the limit as far as I'm concerned. I'm going to be running more equipment, more machines uh, with more people. I'd like to say thank you to everybody for stopping in and taking a look into my operation. It's small, it's in the garage, but this is where everybody starts. Even Bill Gates started in his dad's garage. So. With quality equipment like this, uh, I probably won't be in the garage too long. 